She's big, some might even say huge. This is the new 50 liter cooler and warmer from Makita. First off, how you power this unit is a choose your own adventure. You can use up to two XGT batteries or two LXT 18 volt batteries. You can also use the outlet in your car. It also comes with a wall outlet as well, so you can power it from the wall. Now, it won't charge your batteries while it's plugged into the wall, but it'll get you cold quick, and then you can switch over to your batteries to keep it cold while you're on the go. Maintaining five degrees Celsius, the same as your fridge at home, for 24 and a half hours with just two five amp hour XGT batteries. And it does fit the larger eight amp hour batteries as well. Like me, it's got a rugged design with thermal and weather seals on the food compartment, as well as beefy metal handles and hinges, and that very handy bottle opener up on front. With 50 liters of capacity, you can store up to 68 cans of your favorite thirst quencher or 15 two liter bottles of your favorite soft drink. And the controls couldn't be simpler. You switch between heating and cooling with the settings button and then dial in your desired temperature. For cooling, you can set it between minus 18 degrees and 10 degrees Celsius. For warming, 30 to 60 degrees. After a moment, it'll show you the actual temperature inside the compartment too for your reference. Honorable mentions go to that sneaky USB in the battery compartment so you can charge your phone or device while cooling or heating your food. It's also got a nice rubber bung in the front so you can drain out the storage compartment after use. There's a couple of drink holders up on top and the whole thing doubles as a nice smoko stool as well. So make sure you check it out. It's in stores now at your local Sydney Tools store or go online sydneytools.com.au for all the details on this one and to order your own as well. If you've got any questions, you can always hit me up in that comment section down below. And until next time, I'm Tim. Thanks for watching Sydney Tools TV.